Two teams splitting their first two as we take you to the series finale. It's been all about pitching and defense. Four to one on Friday. Horns win. Lose two to one yesterday. Augie Guerrero will let the team talk about it after the game. And they came out and played well. Sam Stafford getting the start on the weekend, moving from that Tuesday night role. He was solid. And that's Brennan Stewart. First start of the year for the Red Raider from McNeil High School. He'd only pitched 23 and a third coming in, but he went seven plus, and he had a one to nothing lead after Nick Hanslick bloops one into left to score the first run of the game. One to nothing, Red Raiders. And then the Longhorns, they only had three hits heading into the bottom of the eighth inning. But their second one of the inning is Brandon Loy's big RBI single, and that ties the game. And then there are two on for Tant Shepard. You see the Longhorns uh, adopting their version of the Ranger Antler. Shepard into the corner, a two-run triple, giving the Longhorns a three-to-one lead. They scored just eight runs in the series, but it is enough because Corey Knable comes in, gets the final out, his 11th save. Longhorns win the series despite just eight runs. Very big for us, you know. It's these wins in Big 12 are huge. Um, not only that, it gives us confidence going into to Tuesday's game and then next weekend series. And um, you know, it's huge for us. Wins, wins in this conference uh, aren't easy. And uh, we, it was a battle. All three games is a battle. The last hit I got, is, I think it's my only hit this week. Kind of a rough, rough week and everything. Um, you know, and I did get voted one of the, to be one of the team leaders, but it was the other guys that picked me up this weekend. Um, they were there for me when I was down. Um, they had a lot of encouraging words to say. Um, you know, and that's the sign of a good team. So the Horns improved to 27 and 9, more important, 11 and 4 in the Big 12. They host UT Pan American on Tuesday night. And then it's a quick turnaround. They travel to Kansas for a weekend series that's Thursday, Friday, Saturday because of the Easter holiday. Longhorns and Texas A&M tied atop the Big 12 standings coming into the day after the Aggies split their first two with Baylor. Then today, they were down one to nothing when Kevin Gonzalez gives it a ride, and that scores the tying run. Aggies add a run, and Ross Stripling, a complete game four hitter for AM. And so they win to keep pace with the Longhorns atop the Big 12. Oklahoma State also won. They are in third place.